Hi everybody, Susan Batchelder here. My question today is, who is your favorite motivational speaker? There's a reason why I'm asking that question. Watch all the way to the end. It'll just be a short video and you'll understand what I'm getting to. Just think about that for a minute and just answer it for yourself. Who is your favorite motivational speaker or when the words motivational speaker are either read or spoken, who's the first person that comes to mind? So um, Tony Robbins would be a fairly common answer for that. There's thousands, millions, tons of people who are incredibly motivated by listening to what Tony Robbins has to say. He'll often mention this in his talks and he'll say he dislikes when people call him a motivational speaker. He's not a motivational speaker. He's a life coach. And the first time I heard him say that, I honestly didn't really understand it. I didn't, I didn't get it. Once I contemplated it, it was a really awesome moment. It was like, oh, okay, I, oh, I get it. Well, that's powerful. Uh, so take a step back for a bit. Uh, these are some of my favorite topics anyway, but for the last, uh, this week, and um, into the next week and back a few days, a uh, key topic or a main topic of many of my videos, hangouts, and articles is personal power. And how we can have a goal, how we should have a goal, how it should be a really uh, one of our ongoing goals to always aim to have enough personal power or be continually improving our personal power so that we are never powerless in um, situations, in powerless situations. We are not without power or we have enough personal power to get ourselves out of powerless situations. So it's really important to be grooming ourselves and building our personal power all the time. And this relates to this motivational speaker concept. I like the coach, the life coach term for Tony Robbins so much better and many of the other speakers who can really, what they're actually doing is they're coaching us to be stronger, to be better, to challenge ourselves, but really, ultimately, we can only motivate ourselves. We can um, be motivated by triggers, but it has to come from within ourselves. So it's really and truly, we are our best motivational speaker. The language we speak to ourselves is the best possible motivational speaking possible. I'm really looking forward to your comments, your feedback. In the comments below to get in touch with me all my information will be on my channel or I'll also have it in the description below it's Susan Batchelder here otherwise known as Zelenia make it a great day